Hey, welcome back to No Pants Gaming. We are continuing our journey to Canada. Uh, let's see. Should we plow through the road? Should we jump it or just take a detour? How much gas do we have? 42 gas. Let's. Mm, those two options are probably gonna, gonna damage it. Let's just plow through and see what happens. The group decides to take a chance to plow, plow the car through the flooded road. The car gets through, though it takes some damage. That's okay. I guess this is forever now. <laughs> yeah. Yep, it's gonna feel like forever. Alright. The group... Uh, the group lives at Dennis' office, finding some leftover medical supplies and many tentacle eligible tubes of toothpaste. Oh, did I say eligible? I meant edible. I'm sorry. Cool. And so we find a magazine. So, questionable science, lip news, or glares for the sensitive soul. Uh, let's try glares for the sensitive soul. Koba realizes that this magazine has always been corny, but still enjoys optimistic stories. One of the stories about a cat that saves its owner from choking at a buffet. Inspirational. <laughs> awesome. Wish my cat would get in the how like maneuver. That seems like a really trait to, that seems like a good trait to have for a cat. Cool. Alright. Heal a little bit, so we're good. We're good, man. Feeling feeling good, feeling loosey goosey. In the morning, there's a moose outside the camp, and it looks injured, and it's just glaring at the group. Even injured, a moose is still, is still a really powerful creature. Probably best not to mess with it. Yeah, I agree. Just don't mess with the moose. So, we can either treat the energy, Alexis tries to wrestle the moose, or she shoots the moose. Let's, let, let's just leave the moose alone. Let's leave that moose alone. We're, 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 we, we, we've taken a couple hits, so let's not do that. Alright. So we got a hardware store or a gun shop. Uh, gun shop. Let's get some guns. Let's get some guns. I'm not very good with the guns, but NBCs are generally pretty good with the guns. Maybe I'm just not using them. Right. I'm used to melee. Uh, usually, I'm used to melee with my fists and stuff, so I generally don't use guns that much. Uh, but it's also good to have as many guns as possible because when you're getting swarmed, they really come in handy. Extremely handy. Yeah, fuck them up, fuck them up, guys. Yeah. It's not always best to just try to mow zombies down uh, with one character. It's best to just like hit them once and let the group uh, take up the rest. Ah! It's like, come on, do it, do it. I mean, I want that zombie genie. I want that zombie genie. Cause usually zombies are like about like uh, I would say between like one and three hits, depending on how strong your character is or ha or what time of day it is. If it's night, uh, they generally are stronger uh, or at least faster. It's one to two. It's probably both. That makes more sense. I'm so convinced that there's gonna be some kind of like Resident Evil zombie or monster that's gonna come in and try to eat me. Like there's gonna be like a fast red zombie or something like that, or like a t one of those. Like tongue zombies to come out and get me. Yeah, it's gonna be. It's, I, I, I'm convinced. Like the nemesis is just gonna come out of nowhere and it's gonna be fucking terrifying. Like, what can you do? I can barely do anything against the nemesis to begin with. He is just an ass. He's an asshole to fight. All right. Uh, anything in here? No. Okay. Anything in here? What you got in here? What's in here? Yeah, one food, one food, one burger, to rule them all. Double cheese. What am I talking about? All right, let's get some guns. Let's get some guns. Let's get a gun with a good spread. It's got a good spread. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, all right, all right. Ooh, oh, oh, what broke on her? What broke? Oh, it was the, uh, it was the, uh, golf club. So it broke. Man, that lasted a long time. All right. So, is this the end of it? Is this the end of the, end of the road? Up there? Yeah, it looks like it. I can't really tell. Ha! Yeah, yeah, it's the end of the road here. Okay, all right, all right, zombies. All right, all right, all right. We'll, we'll, we'll come back to this house. We'll come back to this house. See if there's anything over here. All right, there's another house over here. Yeah. All right. It's murder. Murder them all. It's zombie Bernie Sanders. Oh no. 
Not Bernie! Ah, this guy looks like Bernie Sanders. <laughs> the white, floofy hair. Uh, Alright. Alright? Right. It is getting kind of dark though, so I need a I need a moosey on out of here pretty pretty soon. Oh, meat cleaver. That's what I wanted to pick up. Um, uh, meat cleaver is a decent weapon. Let's get that to let's get that to get that to MK. Yeah, there you go. He's use that. That's a decent weapon. Yeah, these zombies are uh, definitely getting stronger. Well, let's just get over here. Let's go over here. Let's go over here. Let's have a powwow, guys. I got this. Guys, you guys, you, we're gonna make it to Canada. I believe in us. We're gonna drink the maple syrup and all of it and watch hockey all day. That's what we're gonna do. <laughs> all right. Ha! Wow, I threw that chair to him at a massive rate. Now, hey, sir, this is, I'm getting that chest. I don't care that I, if you want what's inside. You're a zombie, you don't want what's, you don't want that. You want flesh, you want my brain, which isn't very tasty, I imagine. I don't have a big brain. You want a genius. That's not me. You want Kanye. He says he's a genius. He's, he's probably got a good, tasty brain, I imagine. He keeps telling us every day that he's a genius, so I, I imagine so. All right. And, oh, yeah, pick up, pick up that umbrella. Sure. That works. Okay. Oh, it's, yeah, switch to nighttime. Yeah, switch to the ominous music because it's night. They come out in the night. All right, let's get the hell out of here. It's getting dark. It gets real dark. That's why they gave you a flashlight in the, in the last update. Because it gets dumb dark. All right, is there anything in here? No, no, it's just it's just junk house. All right, cool. I don't like the night. I don't like the dark. So uh, let's get the fuck out. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, those are getting into the car. Just bam, bam. My zombie dead. All right, word. Cool, so we got a lot of food. Things are looking up. This is good. Our car's gonna die, though. So that's not good. Things are not looking up, actually. Ah, so we oh, we found a Twinkie truck. All right, so who's, who's gonna get it? Who's gonna get it? Ignore the health freezes? Fuck no, Twinkies are delicious. All right, so Lexus shoots the locks, smash it with something heavy. Let's have MJ try to jimmy it open. MJ starts messing with the lock, he gets nowhere and gets up in frustration. <laughs> nice. I thought he would be able to open it. Right. Oh well. Yeah, this is just like all the zombie online zombie video games, huh? Yeah. There's nothing like Nazi zombies, though. <laughs> Alright, the group cancel up sturdy abilities. He's being over power travel with much of machinery lying around. So we'll make a lot of noise. And we could tinker all night. <sighs> I mean, we're gonna lose the car. So having a good mechanical skill or a better mechanical skill would be better, but let's let's just let's just go to sleep. Let's just go to sleep. So wouldn't that be tired? I'd rather avoid being tired at all costs, especially if we're gonna lose the car, because I doubt that extra mechanic skill would have helped. All right, without a car, the group is a sending duck for bandits. The group is ambushed by awkward bandits that now apologize for their robbery. They're likely new at this. Uh, let's have MJ reason with them. See what that gets us. MJ convinces the bandits to not go through with the attack. They didn't want to anyway. Feeling pity, MK gives them some food. Oh, come on! Don't be nice. Fuck them. <laughs> the group spots a car speeding down the road. Maybe it's a stranger that can help them out. Without slowing down, the driver yells out, NERDS! <laughs> and the car is gone. Oh my god, that's funny. <laughs> I don't think I've had that happen before. Okay, so car preservation tunnel. Okay, cool. So we're gonna get a car here. Late nights search tunnel. Okay, let's get a flashlight out. Uh, what are ev what's everybody's stuff at here? Um, does anybody have any shooting revealed? No. Okay, that's fine. This is that's cool. This is fine. We got it. Well, we should be able to see just fine without uh without uh, any light. Okay, we're good, we're good. Good, good, so good. Good so far. Some gas right there. Let's loop around. Yeah, there we go, there we go. All right, bam, yeah. All right, yeah, Alexis, you use that pistol. You go, girl. You do it. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, this is going good. 
Got a bunch of gas. Hope we get a hybrid car. Yes! Hybrid car for the win. Is there any extra gas? Any extra gas anywhere? All right, get in, get in. Everybody get in. Ah, for it, get out of here. I hope I didn't leave anybody behind. No, I didn't. You can do that. If nobody, if people aren't in the car, you can drive away. All right, cool. I could use some more medical supplies. That'd be helpful. Um, so we have a lot of gas, right? No, we only have 68 gas. Gas station rescue. I think that's a siege, and I rather avoid the gas stations because things can blow up, and I'd rather not have that happen. So let's just go to the junkyard. That's fine. Let's go to the junkyard. Um. Okay. All right. Word. Everybody's got. Everybody got some decent weapons. All right. Let's uh. Let's see what's inside this house first. Ooh, nice tongue, bro. Yeah, nice zombie tongue. Oh, it's a dog. What's up, dog? It's a vicious junkyard dog that wants nothing to do with you. This dog's personality probably wasn't great before the apocalypse either. It's too feral to be even swayed by food. Yeah. Uh, if you have friend the dog um, trait, uh, you can uh, you can. Uh, Get it to get it to be on your team. Otherwise, it's just gonna bite the shit out of you. Come on, let us out. We need to go places, man. We need to get to Canada, man. We need to pee on all that fresh snow. All the nice fresh snow. The mark our territory. <laughs> territory. That territory. <laughs> Where's some of the tongue there? Uh, okay. Uh, let's see some food. So we'll, we'll see what's in the junkyard here. Usually, it's just a bunch of random loot scattered about. Yeah, screw you, zombie. And dumpster diving. Ooh, okay. Ooh, a ball bean hammer. Uh, let's pick up that hammer. I want to get that. I want to pick up that hammer. And let's give that to. Let's give it to MJ. Let's see what he thinks. Yeah, yeah, he likes the hammer. He likes that hammer. Pretty sure it's gonna make him tired, though. All uh, right. Oh, yeah. The tire, spare tires do so much damage. Let me pick up that fire axe now. I'm still unsure, like which, um, what items are like the best and whatnot. I'm not entirely sure. Like, the, the, I, I trust the computer to pick up the better item, mostly, but that isn't always uh, the case. Alright, well, let's, let's go up here, guys. Let's go up here, circle around. You can feel these zombies. Strength in numbers, baby. Strength in numbers. We got this, spam. We're gonna make it to Canada. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. Oh, Canada. Something, something, something. I don't, I don't. That's all I know. That's all I know. That's all we know about Canada. I don't know. It's oh Canada. That's all. That's the only thing I know about. It. <laughs> oh man. I do want to visit Canada someday. I, I have I have a friend that lives up there, and I, I and she says it's pretty pretty tight. A lot of awesome shows come through Toronto too, where she lives. It's it's fucking tight. I want to go there someday. Just not when it's colder. <laughs> it's too cold here now. I don't know if I want to go to a colder place. All right, so five Ben is ambushed the group while they are out of when they are all <laughs> five Ben is ambushed the group while they are about to sneak into a zombie infested house. The band is speaking as we can have was afraid to check an undead attention. Okay, so we can call the bluff or give them ten food. No, fuck that. We're gonna call their bluff. MJ calls the bandits bluff. One of the bandits yells and chaos erupts and the zombies swarm out. Escape was messy. We all got hurt. Fuck. That's not good. I think one of us can get healed, though. Uh, can we recruit Ryan to the team? Ah, uh, no, we got we got a pretty good amount of people here, so we're gonna leave you behind, buddy. Sorry, you got it, man. I believe in you. We'll see you in Canada. We'll share we'll share some pancakes. All right, a bee flies out of the car. Even the window open, it doesn't leave. It keeps flying right into the group's faces. This could be the biggest challenge yet. 
NJ swats the B. I ignore the B. I'm, let's just ignore it. I got I got the oblivious perk. This should help. Corbin completely ignores the B. He somehow didn't he didn't notice it. Everyone follows the example and also ignores the B. The B is still buzzing around the car months after it's abandoned. Just owns that car now for forever. <laughs> oh, it's funny. Okay. At the end of the day, the group side hides in the drafty old house. Some side was roaming outside, and doors of the house are barely on their hitches. Should someone barricade the house? Alright, so with this one, Mechanical helps comes into play. Uh, let's try it. Uh, let's, let's, alright, I'm ballsy. Let's do it. MK, do it. NK barricades on fleeing the house. You could reinforce some problem spots. You now seem very secure. Nice! Good. I was afraid, like, I would get hurt and I would die because I got one health left. I, I hope it's smooth sailing from now on. I hope I get some more medical supplies. MK cuts themselves pretty bad while goofing off in the post apocalypse. He probably needs some stitches in his arm. Uh, he colorizes it, ignore it, and walk it off. It tends to st stitch it up. Uh, does anybody have. Does she have. Any no no no. Uh, I'm just gonna he's gonna colorize his own wounds. M Gay imitates something he saw while watching in the movie Ram Pricks Ram Ram Bukes? He gets a knife really hot and then puts it right on the cut to try to colorize the rune. This was a pretty bad idea. The base is extreme though. The blade stopped. There's no loss. Of, there is no loss of strength in the arm. Nice. Okay. All right. A little bit of morale decrease. That's okay. That's fine. All right, I, I can see myself getting the hockey too. Hockey's pretty awesome, man. All right, so uh, next episode, uh, we're gonna see what happens in this trader camp, man. So uh, thank you all so much for watching. Uh, I will... what? Oh, okay. <laughs> My cat just did something. Did something weird. I thought she was. I thought, I thought she knocked over something. <laughs> I always gotta pay attention to that, that fluffy butthole. All right, so thank you all so much for watching and. I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.